Hey guys, it's great to be back. I know I haven't posted anything on YouTube or Instagram recently. Um, well, any new things, that is, on my Instagram. I have been posting a lot of old pictures. That's why my hair has been like blonde, brown, then blonde again. It's not because I've been dyeing my hair every day. It's because, because I haven't made any new content. Uh, but I'm back now and I'll be making heaps more content. Um, if you guys don't already know, I'm really obsessed with online shopping. I go online shopping all the time, every morning, but I don't buy stuff every morning. I'm just kind of scrolling on the new in sections on ASOS and stuff every morning. Uh, but in saying that, I do buy a lot, but I also return a lot. So I'm kind of evened out in the end. So if I buy something that's six items, I will return like five items and only keep one. Mostly because it either doesn't fit or... Um, the other reason you return something? Okay, because the material is really bad, or either I mostly, I can do most of the time, it's just because I have spent too much money and I'm like, oh no, I really need that money, I should send these clothes back. So that's basically why I return stuff. But I know a lot of my friends can't be bothered to return stuff. They always surprise how I'm walking ridiculously to the post office with like six items in my in my hand. It looks a bit dumb, but anyway. Um, yeah, so I thought I'd create a series where I would buy my favorite online, like new in items and try them on for you guys. So the first video, which is this one, I decided to start with Zara. So I bought seven of my favorite new in items on Zara and I'm gonna try them on for you guys. So get excited. To start off, we have the oversized sweater in neon green, which is this amazing color you see right here. Um, I think it'd go really well with some white pants. The sweater is a perfect size, I think. Well, it is oversized, but I would definitely not go for the medium. Small, definitely. Uh, the sleeves are quite long, which I love because I hate it when they cuff here and they give you like cold wrists. I do not like that. So if you have really long arms or you really love the length to be really long, this would be the perfect jumper for you. Also, um, to comment on the prickliness, because knits always can tend to be quite uncomfortable and itchy, uh, this one is pretty good, I must say, but there are a few. I do feel a little prickles here and there, so it's not perfectly comfortable, but it isn't horrendous. So it's like, I guess in the middle. So, but overall, I think, I think this is a really nice jumper and I would recommend it. So next up we had these teal corduroy pants. I absolutely loved them on the rack. I thought these buttons looked amazing and they were corduroy and they were teal, so I was fluff there. But when I tried them on, I realized that this was an issue. I you can see, but when I wear them, uh, the pockets bulge like this and it makes, cause I have quite wide hips, so it makes me look like I have even wider hips than I in fact do, which really, I don't really want to be ex like, exaggerated at all um besides that they would have been amazing but i guess they are now not not great at all because of look at it it's horrible but i mean they fit really well around the waist i mean there is like i guess a tiny gap here um they are an extra small if you don't have big hips then i would definitely recommend these pants they look absolutely amazing on you but on me they look horrible <laughs> so yeah so if you have a straight body get them if you don't they will do this, unfortunately. Very sad. Yeah. So next up we have this contrast stitching bodysuit. It fit, oh sorry, should have got in there, it's a bit embarrassing. Yep, they're both in. Um, it fits amazingly, this is the size small, yet it hugs the body perfectly and it's not too tight at all. The straps don't kind of come down when you like bend, which I find is really good because you don't want to be out and then feel really insecure about your straps falling down. So I'm also not wearing a bra with this at the moment. Um, if you can see, it has a nice scoop back, which is very flattering as well. I mean, the the V line and the scoop back, like, is a very flattering cut. The only thing that was annoying was um, since it's a bodysuit, you have to clip in, uh, clip the bottom together, which was really actually stressful because I think they needed to make one of the pieces longer so you could comfortably clip it together. I mean, it was a bit difficult, but it's not like really tight and wedging myself, so. So I actually quite like this. I'd also recommend this as well. Very nice. So next up we have the gray turtleneck. My first thoughts are bloody amazing. And this top is super soft. I don't think I've 
tread on anything softer than this. It is, could it actually could pass as pajamas. It is super soft. The arms, I think, are a great length. They are too short. They come over your wrist, which is really good. The sleeves, as I don't know if you can see, but they are they're loose. They're not super tight, which is kind of good because I hate sometimes being in a super tight top. It's kind of nice to have something that's a bit looser. However, this is a medium, so if you want something that's much tighter, I'd probably go for the small. Um, I went for a medium because my shoulders are quite broad, so I didn't want it to be too sh too small up here. Um, and saying that, like, it wouldn't be restrictive because this top is very soft and you can move around in it very easily. The length is very good as well because it's not too long, so when you tuck it in, I mean, it's not, you don't have to see it underneath your pants either. Um, yeah, I just think I'm in love with this top and I think I need like 10 of them. I think I'm wearing the comfiest outfit that was ever worn. And these pants are also super comfortable like this top is. Um, they, I mean, would be perfect for laying around the house or even just going to get brunch. Like, you know those days where you can't be bothered to really get changed but you want to wear something super comfortable? This is definitely what this is for. They have two pockets at the front. You can see here, um, which is also in my love pockets. The great thing about these pants as well is that you can um, you can tighten them and they're high waisted. So I can, t I mean, I can kick, put them probably all the way up to here, which I love high waisted things. Um, the drawstring can you can make it, I guess, as tight as you want, and you can that means you could also, I guess, wear it low waisted if that's what you prefer. But we all know high waisted is much better. <laughs> so yeah, uh, they're very soft and they fit really well, they make your butt look good. Uh, this is a size, I think, let me, let me, let me have a look, I kind of forgot. Yeah, these are a size small. Um, definitely wouldn't have changed my size, this is perfect. They also are quite stretchy, so yeah. Also amazing and would definitely recommend. So next up we have this lovely blouse. It's a really nice terracotta color, which kind of matches my lipstick, which was actually a coincidence. <laughs> Um, but my first impressions were super soft, super comfy. The yeah, the material is very soft and it's quite flowy, so it doesn't really restrict you. And I find that even though I have the top button done up on the collar, it's not suffocating me and strangling my neck. Um, there is a lot. If you can, there's like I can stick my two hands in there, and it's like really comfortable man space, which is awesome. I don't know if I would go down a size, actually this is a size small if I go to an extra small because I know it is quite flowy but I guess that's just the nature of the top. I went with the small because I have broader shoulders and um, usually if it has a cut off it gets really like restricting but this top is not restricting at all to be in. Um, so overall I really like it, would recommend. Next up we have this off-white textured dress, I really loved it when I saw it on the model online but now I absolutely hate it for several reasons. One, it is really see-through. Do you probably see my underwear? Because like, I didn't think this dress was that see-through. I mean, I don't know, you probably wouldn't be able to wear it unless you wore a slip underneath it or if you were going to the beach or if you did like everything to be shown. Either way, I don't like it, as well as the cut is horrible as well. I don't know if you can see, but there's like all this kind of extra material around here um this like why is this here doesn't do anything for you it just makes you look a bit like gross because it gives you no shape so i would say this is a no and don't buy this dress um i mean it may look better on you but than me but um yeah i just i'm not really a fan the only thing i liked is the buttons the buttons are cute but there's more to address than just the buttons. But yeah. I don't like. <laughs> so that's everything. I forgot to say earlier that I'm not keeping all these items that I show you. I definitely won't be. I will be sending most of them, if not all of them, back. Only the ones that I truly love I will be keeping. Um, so I think I'm going to be tossing up between keeping the grey turtleneck, the navy blue comfy pants, and the... Um, so the the bodysuit, the black one with the contrast stitching, I think they were definitely my favourites. Um, I mean, it's a shame about the turquoise pants. I'm not turquoise, the teal, or the, the teal pants. Um, I mean, they looked absolutely amazing. 
well on the shelf, but then when you tried them on, they, they didn't really, they were sad because they, they bulked at my hips. <laughs> um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video and maybe found something that you liked or, you know, on the contrary, was gonna buy, we're gonna buy something and now not buying it because you realize that it's actually, I mean, there's quirks to it that you didn't know about. So if I helped you in some way, I'm very glad. Well, I hope you have a great afternoon or whatever time it is that you're watching this video. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.